Hey everyone, Tyler from MacroOps, and today we're going to talk about how Stan Druckenmiller mastered markets and what we can learn from his incredible performance, starting with his personality traits. This guy was an absolute beast. He had all five of these locked down. He had mental flexibility, independent thinking, extreme competitiveness, tireless inquisitiveness, and deep self-awareness. Try to incorporate these into your process and you'll become a better trader for it. Druck also taught us that earnings do not move the market. It's the Federal Reserve Board. So we want to be paying attention to the Fed's actions and what they're doing with liquidity. Extremely important. Druck also taught us that valuation is absolutely useless to time markets. Just freaking useless. We want to be using technicals to time all of our trades. And I'm sure you guys seen a chart like this. This is the Schiller P-E ratio. Had you used this to try to time the markets in the late 90s, you'd have gotten absolutely blown out because it said it was overvalued. It continued to go up and got even more overvalued. And same thing now in present day time. All right, so we do not want to be using valuation to time markets. We want to be using technicals. Druck also gave us the key to how to make long-term outsized returns, and that is betting big on the fat pitch. So when the stars align, you got to go for the jugular. You have to be a pig, and you need to bet big when the good opportunities come up because they're pretty rare. The corollary to that is don't bet capital on low conviction setups. All right, just let them pass and don't waste financial and mental capital on them. Now, I want to draw a quick diagram to better illustrate what Druck meant by betting big on the fat pitch. So markets are mostly efficient, and I'm going to represent that by this E here. And as markets go along, they're mainly efficient. There's small deviations from the efficient state. And then every once in a while, there's a large deviation from the efficient state. And this is what Druck calls the fat pitch. And we want to be betting big here because when it returns to efficiency, you would make a lot of money. We don't want to be wasting our time on these small little deviations because they're just not worth the financial and mental capital. Focus on the large deviations from efficiency and bet big on them. So Juck also told us that you have to press a hot hand. And that means a hot hand is when you're up about 30 to 40% of the year. You can use that house's money to go for a 100% year and really boost your long-term track record. So many guys get that, that decent year and they just go to the beach and they said, I'm done. I did pretty well this year. Uh, you know, I don't want to try for that 100%. But Druck never stopped. When he had it, when he knew where the market was going, he tried to shoot for the stars. And that's what really contributed to his amazing long-term track record. And finally, Druck was an absolute beast on controlling his ego. So he detached his ego from all of his trade outcomes. He was able to take losers and winners without emotion, which is absolutely key. So the markets are going to deliver you losses. The markets are going to deliver you winners. The key is not getting jostled around by those and staying calm and collected as you move forward. Thanks for checking us out today. If you want more Druck action, go to macrodashops.com. We have a lot of material on him on our website or follow us on Twitter at macroops and subscribe. Subscribe for this channel for next videos. Thanks for listening, guys.